drop it. So, hey guys, geeks and girls, welcome back to another vlog diary entry. This will this will be a um, bit of a different one because uh, this will be a behind the scenes kind of in the making of the documentary. Do you hear noise off the background? That's just Jensen. So, um, if you just didn't already know, if you hadn't watched my other videos, um, I know that I've sp talked about making a documentary and I was going to make it on anxiety and mental health and everything like that, but with everything that's been going on, it's just kind of like, not, you know, I, I kind of don't want to make one on mental health right now. So I'm making a documentary on Patrick Brown. So if you don't know who Patrick Brown is, he's a local artist that does work for Marvel Comics. Um, it's pretty insane that we have someone that works for Marvel in Tasmania. So, uh, I'm doing it on, he's, he's the guy that did our wedding invitations, he's done some stuff like this, this, and this. So, he's um, I'm a, an amazing artist, and, uh, and I just can't wait to do this film, it's going to be great. Um, his Instagram is down in the description below. And we had a post that uh, we were talking about documentary uh, title ideas because we just didn't really, I didn't really know what to call it. The whole, the thing, the working title I've had going is uh, Infinity Draw. You know, play on words with Infinity War. <laughs> so in this book, I've been working hard on doing everything and all the preparation that we've been doing. But, um... So we ran a post the other day and it got a lot of traction, which I'm really, really happy about. So we've got an audience um, on the title of the film. So um, I'm going to read a couple that are kind of cool. Um, so, because uh, the working title is Infinity Draw, but um, we had a couple of really, really good ones that um, on Instagram. And if you want to leave a, a suggestion uh, for anything to do with the film, Leave it in the uh, in the comments, or go to Patrick's Instagram and post it on one, on one of those uh, pictures uh, relating to the documentary. So uh, we've got Marvel's Infinity Draw. That's a given because that was a working title. We've got the Art Avenger. We have Modern Marvel. We have Art to Astonish. With great art comes great creativity. I don't mind that one, but Excelsior Art. That one's pretty cool. Uh, your Friendly Neighbourhood Patrick. <laughs> Marvelous. Drew Believer. I don't mind that one. Shades of Brown. Hero Hands. The Artistic Avenger. The Amazing Art Man. That's probably one of my favourites. The Artistic Art Man. Or the Artistic Avenger. That's pretty cool. My Sketchy Job. <laughs> I like that as well. Brown pages or brown paper, because his last name is Brown. I also had I, I did text him and said uh, Fifty Shades of Brown, but then that uh, that'll just that'll be probably a, a good documentary if he was a plumber. So yeah, um, we have been that they are the titles that we're, we're, we're that you that you guys and the, the Instagram followers have come up with. So um, if you got any suggestions for it, make sure to leave a comment. You know, anything superhero related or anything to do with, with uh, you know, play on words and stuff. It's really cool to, to see people's creativity come out. And, you know, we've got a competition going. Um, and the winner that we pick um, is going to get a signed copy from both me and Patrick. Uh, Blu-ray copy of the film. Um, all DVD covered and nice, nicely presented. Uh, sent to you and, you know... Not that it's anything amazingly like spectacular, but it's it's for you guys to to get involved with the filmmaking process, and it's going to be a lot of fun to to see this film progress. And um, yeah, so I went to his house the other day, and uh, we filmed some just some cutaway shots, uh, some practice cutaway shots, and some photos, and framing, and, uh, and, and some framing. So. Uh, yeah, it's it's really good that I actually went went and saw because 
the, the thing with film these days is there's a lot about safety and hazards and risk assessments. And back when I did film 10 or 12 years ago, there was none of that. There was just kind of like, go out, just be safe, you know. But you've got to kind of like, even the most mundane film sets, you've got to treat as like everything will kill you. <laughs> it's like, I went to Patrick's house and he's turned his little office into a gym. Um, so he's got a big weight, weight system and, uh, and uh, treadmill and all that sort of stuff. Kind of glad I went and saw that because they are risks. You know, it, it's just like... <laughs> You could trip over and it's almost like a Final Destination type of like death. You know, like, oh dear, I fell and I tripped on a rope and then I all of a sudden fell over and broke my arm and then rolled into and broke my neck. It's just it's some of the most mundane things. I saw a risk assessment like an example the other day at school and it was like the office and then it said my chair. Be careful because it swings back a little bit. You know, it's just like you gotta have, you gotta have it written down just in case someone comes along or some actor comes along and goes too far back and you know breaks something and they're like that wasn't on the risk assessment. <laughs> it's a lot of extra work when you think about it, but it does you know kind of cover everyone's ass uh, at the end of the day. So. But anyway, I'm super, super, super excited with all the negativity going on um, the last couple of weeks. I'm just so excited to put all my energy into this this uh, creativity uh, outlet and just go full steam ahead. And I cannot wait. And I know Patrick can't wait. It's going to be like our little baby, you know. It's going to be my assessment task to hand in for film to thing, but it's also going to be his thing that he can take wherever he wants so he's got a documentary of his stuff so I can't wait so yeah if you want to be any if you want to be in the film process or anything that we, we have to do make sure to subscribe uh, turn notification bells on make sure to follow me and Patrick on uh, Instagram um, or even our Facebook pages um, Patrick Brown art and or the artwork of Patrick Brown or I think it's called and Geek Have Vlogs um, I'll be posting a lot more stuff about getting involved and, and all that sort of stuff. We're, we're even thinking of shooting a funny, like, um, scene to, to uh, kind of introduce the whole documentary, like, more of a, like a superhero scene. So, I don't know how ambitious that's going to be and how uh, we're going to do it, but it's going to be fun to do. So, yeah. So, yeah, follow us on if you want to keep up to date with all the stuff going on with the film. Any, anything, like I'll just be doing little diary entries like this and also uh, showing you stuff like I just showed you at Pat Patrick's um, little office and stuff. So, yes, I cannot wait to show you guys any, just, I can't wait to show you guys. Um, it's going to be so much fun. Alright guys, so yeah, make sure to subscribe, follow us on our social medias um, it's, and everything like that. Uh, turn post notifications on, make sure to stay weird. Keep smiling, guys, and um, catch you in the next episode or vlog or whatever. Love you guys to bits. It's good to be back and talking to you guys. I've missed you.